So as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe, and this is Blue Over Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for all of the twin and twin and twins, ninja. So if you in any way at all identify as a DF, Divine Feminine, or a DM, Divine Masculine, then this reading is for Joel, all right? Now, first of all, pre-shuffle, we got reminiscent, okay? Reminisce on the love we had. You are everything, okay? So that's what I'm getting. Somebody is reminiscing on the love that you guys had with each other, and they feel like you are everything, all right? You are everything. Everything about you is it for them, okay? So let us see what messages come out here for the twins on today. Hope that you guys are doing well. Happy Daddy's Day to all of the fathers out there. Aw, dads are so important, so special, you guys. So special, so important. All right, let us see what we got going on here for our twins. Oh, okay, we got bounty hunters. Somebody is chasing you down, okay? Because there's a physical location change. This person is about to move. They're about to relocate, or they literally have just recently moved or relocated to where you are. They're trying to let you know, and they can't get in contact. Why? Because you're trying to cleanse your energy, and maybe they're in that of which you're trying to cleanse. You know, you're like, mm, I'm trying to cleanse all old things you and this person could have been married you're no longer married or maybe you thought you and this person were going to get married you didn't you get what i'm saying this person could have gone through a divorce recently also once again guys not something we will wish for for anybody you get what i'm saying but if that's what comes up then that's what i'm going to read and look i'm shuffling and what keeps coming out okay so somebody went through a separation somebody went through a divorce okay unfortunately it happens it's life you, you don't, you know, plan on that, but it happens, okay? So we have come together. Why did it happen? Because there's a reconciliation taking place between you and them, okay? Yeah, so this is a risk, a chance that they were willing to take, okay? Okay, so let us see. The rest of this for the twins. I love it. I love when the twins are able to just take that risk and go towards each other and say, F it. You get what I'm saying? F what anybody and everybody else thinks, you know, Time for you guys to be happy. You deserve it, right? So, magnetic. Yeah, they're constantly drawn back to you. You're constantly drawn back to them. Eventually, it gets old. It's like, all right, so what are we doing, right? Yeah, loss. Because you don't like when we're not in contact. You feel like somebody's trying to retaliate. You feel like somebody's trying to come after you or somebody's trying to get you back. So, then you hunt me down. So, at what point are you going to realize maybe the risk just needs to be taken? So, I think that's what somebody has <laughs> come to the conclusion of here okay somebody has realized you know what? i just need to go ahead and take that leap of faith towards my person because they're my person i love them i can't stay away from them and you know i just feel really really lost without them okay that's what i'm getting here um somebody i just keep hearing that song speeding by omarion they feel like their time was um running out so they had to hurry up yeah and make themselves available it keeps coming out like that this person has eyes for you and only you okay i keep hearing that and i only have eyes okay so they only have eyes for you okay only for you so i don't know it's really really cute all right um let us see what are the messages Ooh, okay they feel like you're something they must have okay mm. <laughs> this part is not going to resonate with everybody okay but this is for a group of you who have been you know sexually active with your twin before they feel like it's something they have to have again okay you got the good stuff you got the good but it's not yet, okay and they need it they need it and they like they need it and they want it i just heard i need it and i want it woman okay so that's really funny okay so they like they need it and they want it and now okay not later <laughs> And then not now, but right now. That is hilarious. Remember that? Not now, right now. Parents used to say that shit all the time. But that's how they feel. Okay. Okay, Zaddy. Mm -hmm. Or Mommy. Mommy is saying she need it right now. She said she need it right now. <laughs> I cannot with you guys. It's so fresh. All right. What is this? Yeah, we got meeting. Oh, they go to that song by Silk. All right. Lord have mercy. It's a meeting in the bedroom. Lord of mercy. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, let us see. 
So we have karmic, all right? So yeah, there's a lesson that has been learned here, guys. And I feel like the person has been on an up and down roller coaster while dealing with the karmic. This is why, you know, a lot of you choose not to deal with them. However, what they're trying to let you know is that they're coming back. They're on their way back or that they are back or, you know, it's something about this karmic cycle here. All right, give us more on this karmic cycle. What about this karmic? They're sending you telepathic communication to tell you they, are, they discarded it. It's over, like I said. They're looking for you as to how to tell you. You're nowhere to be found. Gotcha. <sighs> this could have also been past energy. They could have been on a break. They could have been over. Person could have just moved into their home. They were trying to reach out to you. They wanted you. They wanted to meet up with you, come together with you. They wanted to take that risk, see what you wanted to do. You never responded or you were non-responsive. You had the person blocked. Karmic came back, they got back together, now they are just together. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, so that's what I'm getting here. Could also be something like that, because history is here. All right, but let us see. What else do the twins need to know? What else do the twins need to know? Okay, yeah, we got denial and TikTok. Yeah, so somebody denied you for that very reason. Excuse me, there's a lot that you don't know that they want to tell you. Okay, they want to tell you, and when they tell you, they want to know, are you open to, you know, even though the past is the past and you can't do anything about it now, can you do something about it moving forward? Like, can we, um, how do I put this? We can't change the past, right? So we can't necessarily do anything about that, but we can do something about right now, right? So what do you want to do about this is basically what they're saying. You know, let me put this information out there for you, and with this information, what do you want to do with it? You know what I mean? Type shit. So, yeah, we have realization and we have love affair, okay? Because at the end of the day, they're saying, ah, Jesus. Mm -mm -mm. For a lot of you, that's exactly what it was. The person had got out of a situation with that individual. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Um, they wanted you. They were looking for you. You were nowhere to be found. You get what I'm saying? And the, the karmic came back. Whoop, there they were. You get what I'm saying? Uh, space and opportunity and they moved their ass right up in that house or you get what I'm saying something along those lines is kind of what I'm seeing here okay um yeah so let's clear this up but that's what happened all right so this person wants to come towards you because they feel like you're something that they must have yeah we can't change the past but you know do over and they keep saying that right and for a lot of you who do have this person blocked they have access to you via um, fake social media, fake profiles. You get what I'm saying? So, okay. Let's get some messages of love. But let's see, man. We got protected, second chance. Yeah, so they want a second chance with you. They're like, this time will be different. You know, we're going to have our boundaries in place. I've mastered my karmic lesson. And I'm just being patient and waiting on you, right? Like, I'm ready to take this leap of faith when you're ready to have me, you know? I'm, I'm going to take the leap of faith when you'll have me. Will you have me now? Shit, but I'm taking the leap of faith now. You get what I'm saying? It's that type of thing. So, yeah, we have different pages. In the past, yeah, it was because you guys were on different pages. Once again, keeps coming out about child or children. Something about child or children and longing. This person is continually longing for you, yearning for you, desiring you. All right? Something about addiction here, okay, and abundance. This person could have also had addiction. So, you could have had child or children. They could have had addiction. You know, addiction, child, and children don't mix. You get what I'm saying? So they could have tried to stay as far away from you as possible because of that addiction. You get what I'm saying? And something about their integrity. Regardless to how much they wanted you, they still had integrity. And child and children don't go around addiction. You get what I'm saying? Type of shit. So if they know they had problems or things they needed to rectify, they were going to do that prior to coming around you with their problems. Yeah. Crossroads. All right? So contrary to the belief you get what i'm saying you're gonna do what's best for you and at the time might have seemed like the karmic was what was best for them because they get to have a relationship and you know not be affecting child or children because maybe the karmic didn't have child or children okay so it's all about your perception and how you look at the situation we have material world i feel like this person is, like i said got caught up in the 3d world all right but they have learned their lesson okay um and now we have creativity so 
you and this person are possibly going to come together working on some creative projects there's probably some things that you have in the making um some things that you're going to discuss prior to the 21st so what's today the the 18th or something like that so what y'all going which i got like a few days to make some, to make some plans or have some discussions about some creative ideas you guys have or something this could also be um just simply you sparking this person's creativity it says bringing out the greatness within all right so you bring out the greatness within this person as opposed to just keeping them stuck and trapped in the money career status you know what i mean outside type of shit excuse me world <laughs> all right let us see sheesh all right so we have deception regret yes yeah, so they regret lying to you all right, and in the summertime, like I said, just a few days away, all right, you're going, to, you're going to see some progress, okay? Desire outcome is here on the horizon. Result, conclusions, ending, you will get a resolution. Compromise, that's the second time we're seeing that. So they want to come to some sort of agreement with you, all right, or some sort of compromise. Let us see here from the Dear Empress. There's nothing in this world I wouldn't do for you. Any obstacle or challenge is minute compared to my love for you. In order for this to work, we have to be honest with one another. All right. So they want to come forward and tell you the truth. Take this mask of deception off. All right. Let us see. And say, hey, maybe we can't be together in this way because, you know, whatever happened in the past. But we can still work together in this way if you would like. You get what I'm saying? Now, here's the thing about that. Be careful because you guys are twins. So you're always going to be drawn to each other in um in a very intense way all right and um hmm. so let us see what we have we have everything happens for a reason trust that spirit knows all things allow this time to unfold naturally yes yeah, so in their mind they feel like y'all gonna be together again anyways it's, it says the more you love on yourself the more i fall in love with you all right and sometimes i stay awake thinking of you i want to make this happen i need you to give me a sign all right so if you want to use this deck in your own readings it's available for purchase over on my website that information can be found in the description box as well as info on how to book a personal all right any of the merchandise anything like that okay over there over there over there let us see <clears throat> okay so you have surprise, all right? You may be about to be surprised, all right? So the person plans on surprising you. They have some things up their sleeve, all right? Labyrinth, even when you feel lost, there is always a way through the labyrinth and bond. Aww. A love bond grows stronger over time. Underlying energy is soul. Your soul is preparing to reconnect. Trust in the process. Yeah, you guys have this undeniable connection and I feel like you're about to open up to one another in the deepest of ways because you're about to study spirituality together and so from doing that and getting closer to god together i mean and then creating together it's like the karmic cycles are going to complete on their own you get what i'm saying um so yeah like they said just allow for things to happen naturally yeah you are this person's entire heart and i feel like they're your heart too it says, you begin to feel your heart beat faster when you are close. Aww, spiritual. See, your spiritual journey is beginning. Yeah, this is a true spiritual slash soulful connection. You guys are friends, you're lovers, you're going to be business partners. Yeah, this this is everything right here. I, I really like this right here. All right, so this was your reading or you enjoyed it, which is 1331 on a timestamp. So there's definitely a transformation that is about to bring you guys into union. 448, some karmic lessons have been completed. Yes, indeed. Um, like I was saying, if this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hair grease.